my new Orleans trip. Hello everybody, my name is Reese. Welcome to my channel. Today I'm going to be making a video about my New Orleans trip. First of all, if you're wondering why I am filming in a mud pit, go check out my previous video. The link will be in the description below. I guess I'm considering it kind of like a senior trip because I don't go on the trips with the band every year but I am going to this one and it is to New Orleans which is kind of a big deal because I've never been anywhere outside of like the southern region of the United States. The first day I leave is Sunday and we're leaving at 9 a.m. and it's gonna take us 12 hours to drive to New Orleans. I don't think it's gonna be too bad because we're getting one of those charter buses that has Wi-Fi and it has a bathroom and it has like little uh, charging outlets and stuff so it shouldn't be too bad but I guess it just depends on who I'm sitting by. <laughs> the whole entire first day is just going to be 12 hours worth of bus travel which is really it's just not going to be that great. <laughs> on Monday the very first thing that we're doing once we get to New Orleans and get settled in is going to Mardi Gras World. Now I've never been to Mardi Gras, I've never seen Mardi Gras, but I have seen a lot of videos of the party beads and the little street performers and the little the little kid street performers and stuff I heard. It's pretty much just a tour of the building that they build all of the Mardi Gras floats in. They actually make floats for about 40 different parades a year. Not only floats, but also costumes and things like that. And I'm not really sure what this is, but apparently we get a free piece of king cake. <laughs> but I'm sure it's good and it's free so I'm in. Later on that day we are going on a Cajun Pride Swamp Tour. <coughs> oh. It's a swamp in a bayou <coughs> which I'm not really sure what that is but it's a motor coach ride across the Mississippi River and then a tour in the Louisiana swamps. Um, I'm not sure what a motor coach is either. Obviously, I'm gonna find that out. Maybe I'll put a little picture right here or something of what a motor coach is. But yes, um, I'm excited about going into the swamps just because they have alligators, snakes, maybe raccoons, and a lot of really cool wildlife, I'm guessing. It might stink a little bit though, because I'm around this mud right now and it does kind of sneak a little bit and I know that swamps are pretty muddy. The last thing that we're doing on Monday is going to the outlet at Riverwalk. I'm hoping that this is where we'll see a lot of street performers as in like musicians and stuff and we'll get to sit at a nice jazz club and just watch the water, maybe hear some live music, I'm not sure. It's gonna be a chill night and it's gonna be really great to just explore right in the center of New Orleans. On my next day in New Orleans, Tuesday, and my last day in New Orleans, Tuesday, we are going to Jackson Square. This is a very historical part of New Orleans, but the best part about Jackson Square is that there's been an open air artist colony there for over half a century, which is, if I'm going to spend my money on anything at New Orleans, it'll probably be on a piece of artwork or something that I find in Jackson Square. I don't know, something that I just can't get from here, obviously, because it wouldn't be a souvenir otherwise. But yeah, a lot of the artists hang their paintings or whatever, I'm not sure exactly, obviously I've never been, but they hang all of their paintings on the iron fence, and I guess you can just walk around and see all their artwork and everything like that. After we're done exploring in Jackson Square, we are going on a steamboat tour or I guess it's a steamboat cruise. It's a jazz brunch cruise I think on the Mississippi River but don't quote me on that. Um, that is gonna be another really chill part. Uh, we're just gonna get to listen to jazz, eat a lot of Cajun food, dirty rice, I don't know, stuff like that. Dirty rice, cornbread, stuff like that. The next thing that we're doing for that day and probably one of my favorite parts about the trip is the Audubon Aquarium. Now I'm not sure if that's how you pronounce it but that's how I'm gonna say it. Um, I've never been to an aquarium that was just an aquarium. Like I've been to the zoo that has the fish part of it and the underwater part of it, but I've never been to a building that is only an aquarium. And this is like my dream. I'm pretty sure they have one of those tunnels that you can walk through where every, like you are in the aquarium pretty much. And there's like stingrays and you can pet them and stuff and there's turtles 
everything. It's going to be awesome. The very last attraction that I'm going to while I'm in New Orleans is a haunted tour, obviously. I hear ducks. But yes, New Orleans is said to be one of the most haunted places, so of course we have to go on a ghost tour. I'll probably put some of it in that day's vlog, but I'll honestly probably just dedicate a whole video just to the ghost tours. Oh, I forgot to mention, I'm pretty sure it's a walking ghost tour, which I always feel like is more creepy because you can just... I don't know, something, you just feel more vulnerable, I guess. Nothing's behind you or whatever. I will either be posting them on Monday and Tuesday night, or I will post them on Wednesday on the 12 hour drive home. I'm not sure yet. I'm just very, very excited for this trip, and I'm so excited to go somewhere that I've never been before. I've just, I don't know, I've just had such a longing to do this and get away for so long, and it's gonna be so refreshing and so great to do that. So yes, that is what is in store for this next upcoming week for my channel. I'm really excited to put something like this on my channel because it's it's going to be a great, great memory and I think they're going to be pretty good vlogs. So yeah, be sure to watch those when I post them and thanks for watching! Look at all the ducky dudes! Also, if you haven't seen my new piercing yet, it's probably because you don't follow me on Instagram, so... Go follow me on Instagram, link is in the description below. Hi.